Hey McDivers, welcome to another video. Today I'm doing my October Ipsy bag unboxing. So like usual, it came in the pink packaging and oh my gosh, this month's bag is totes adorbs. Look, it like it's not actually lace, but it looks like it's lace and then it has this little bat on the, um, for the zipper. Oh my gosh, so stinking cute like i don't need any more bags but i'm keeping this one i love halloween oh so cute um anyways i have one thing that didn't fit in the makeup bag in the packaging first thing is the bye bye pores pressed powder by it cosmetics i actually requested this i finally figured out how to request items because i guess well Okay, they were doing it so you can email them at ipsycare.com or something and you can request from a few different items if you wanted something in particular. And this is the second month and I also requested an item for next month. But then I read they're taking that away so I'm super duper upset because I just really like that. I think it's so cool that you can pick one thing. You know, that's how I got the ColourPop lippy last month that I was like dying over. And I forgot what I picked for next month, but this was my pick for this month and you can't do it anymore. So I wish I could tell you that you could, but no, you can't. I mean, I'm gonna keep Ipsy, but shh, sucks. Anyway, so it just opens up. It has this little sploogy splun, <laughs> sploogy sponge, sploogy splunge. Jesus, man. Um, anyways, I tried it one other day. Oh, I tried all these products too, BT dubs. Um, I used it with this and because I know sometimes it comes with that and then I also used it with like a little uh, brush. Both worked fine. I'm wearing it today. I really like it. Uh, I don't know if I like it as much as my Dior powder. I have the Dior Skin Forever powder. I think I like that a little better, but I'm going to keep using this. It works, so I really like it. It's a good size too. And we'll get into the products inside the bag. Oops. First thing is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. And they actually did really well with the shade. They gave me shade Y225. And I have, I have this already in two other shades. Um, let me see if I can grab them. Please hold. Okay guys, welcome back. I just wanted to grab the two other shades that I had because I think they did a really good job uh you know figuring out your shade based upon your what is it beauty profile or whatever so again they gave me y225 and i have the shade y245 and y325 so this is a little light i'm actually wearing it today i just uh went a little heavier on the bronzer but it works like and that's a pretty good size and it's, it's a pump let me show you, let me put these down. You can tell I really like this foundation. Um, yeah, so see, it's a little pump. So nice. Like, I am pleasantly surprised. I mean, I feel like everybody's tried this foundation already, but I welcome this. This is going to be perfect, like, in my bag, if I ever go anywhere, which I don't, but you know. Anyways, let's move on. Next thing I'm grabbing is the Studio Makeup Gloss. I'm wearing it today. I actually am wearing Urban Decay's 1993. I lined my lips with it and filled it in and then put this over. And I did wear this alone the other day when I was just like running errands and it's actually really nice. I've never heard of this brand before, but it's really pretty and I'm so excited that gloss is making a comeback. I love matte lips and I love liquid lips, but I don't know why I've, I've always loved gloss. So I'm just so happy that, you know, I'm seeing it more, but this is a really beautiful color. I don't know, is it called Kiss? SLG-07 Kiss, I guess that's the name, but I really like it a lot. So I'm gonna keep this. Next thing is the Chella Eyebrow Pencil in Beautiful blonde. I think that's a full size. I'm not sure. I'm wearing it today. I went a little heavier because I like a bit of a darker brow. 
but this actually worked very nice. Not my favorite, but I'll keep it. I'll use it. And then the last thing is, so cute. Look at this. It's a little macaroon. It's a lip balm. It's so cute. I've used it a couple times. It's just clear lip balm. It doesn't have a very strong aroma. I don't know what the hell it smells like. It smells pleasant though. Um, but I just think it's so cute. I'm going to keep this in my handbag. And the last thing is just the card. In my defense, the moon was full and I was left unsupervised. Unsupervised. Spellbound. Anyways, I really liked this month. Um, I think I'm keeping all of it. Wow. Yeah, I'm keeping all of it. I'm not passing any, even the bag. So yay, Ipsy October. I'm really into it. And I really like how all of these products perform. All right, guys. Well, please like this video, subscribe, hit the bell button. It's going to notify you every time I upload. If you have any questions, leave them down below, any requests, anything like that. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, McJibbers.